Alright, three, two, one, go! Bash, skip everything! I probably shouldn't have a split for like robbing the McPherson's mansion because it's only like a 30 second split. Oops, too much bashing. Doors open. Excuse me. All right, now for the one unskippable thing. Oh. Yeah, as you probably saw from that one, like the first part of the run is super casual, not a big deal. And then there's just boss after boss. <laughs> so it's like, oh jeez. So I feel like the first part might be a little bit too boring. But then it's just like, oh god, everything at once. But yeah, we gotta remember, pick up the pistol bullets. Okay, other unskippable cutscene. <laughs> oh yeah, it does kind of pan over to an unbroken window, doesn't it? Oh no! They fix it really quickly! Let's see, oh. Yeah, da -da -da. Best weapon in the game. Mashing unnecessarily. There we go. I want to go this way. Game gets mad at us. Don't care. Up the stairs. Okay. Gotta go get the password memo and the videotape. Yeah, I am glad to figure out that you don't need the hazmat suit for like the uh, the whole environmental tech lab because you actually just get one if you forgot to pick it up. So that actually saves a little bit of time. Screwdriver, Morris. Hi, Morris. Okay, got the screwdriver. Doors unlocked. Unlock the door, now we're gonna turn on the elevator. Last but not least, key card with the screwdriver. Back down the elevator. Here's the key card. Skip a bunch of scenes. Right in this room I don't care about. Skip some more scenes and then suddenly we're in a fight. Whew. Okay, remarks that we should probably not be in here because there's deadly things. He probably just killed somebody. Gotta go back up the elevator. Hopefully before Raina gets hit. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm hearing the voices, but I don't know if there's even anyone in that room. Excuse me. Best weapon in the game. Need to get better at this one. Oh. All right, so now we just gotta talk to Morris. More cutscenes.
Alright, uh, time for hardest boss fight in all of video gaming. Ah. Oh, you actually got a hit on me. No! How could you? Oh, oh no, I actually goofed the cycle. No! I got arrogant and went too early. Really? Twice? Oh, but I actually got a crit because his head jumped up and I hit his head with the knife. That was actually... New strat? New strat? New strat. Yay, minus six on that split. I'm almost certainly gonna do worse on this split though if I'm gonna grab the bullets. We do know that those are those med kits are apps not the cabinet, the door! K please! <laughs> We're doing a speed run here. Alright. Yeah, this split's gonna be awful. Woo! Alright, Kay, grab the bullets and let's go. Like the bullets aren't even out of the way, there's no reason not to grab them. <laughs> Actually, so that wasn't the end of the world for a split. Alright. Let's keep going. Alright, we left Raina behind, so we don't have to worry about her getting killed. Ricky's here. We can skip that. I hate it when you barely miss and click on something else in case it's like, that's a chair! Why would I care about a chair? I'm like, I'm sorry! <laughs> Alright, this time we actually have bullets for the gun. So unlike last time, we won't run out of bullets after a couple. Aha! Uh -huh, don't get caught! Second time saying hi to Ricky. We don't actually need to do anything here. Is there gonna be someone here? Ah! Oh! I dodged you! I'm getting better at that! Ha! Hopefully I'm not making the mic peek when I shot like that. Sorry if I am. Alright, send a message to Raina. Alright, we said hi. That's all that matters. Alright, the enemy didn't spawn that time. Time for the plant boss, we'll never actually fight. Excuse me. Ah, no! Alright, we got the bomb thing. Alright, perfect. This part of the game really like screwed me up the first time I'm playing, but now that I have everything written down, it's actually really short. Ah! He's right next to me. Excuse me! That was actually really weird. Ah! I'm being raided and I'm not exactly sure what that even means. Hello! <laughs> this is Seven Mansions. Uh... Yeah, really bad horror game, and slowly learn practicing a new route. <laughs> oh, thank you. Ooh. Yeah, this is the game that I translated. I figured it'd be fun to get people to speedrun it, and more people might see it this way too. Thought I wanted to see how quick we could break it. So the file, the computer's missing a bio, so we have to ask Reyna to send it from another place. Let's see. So now I have to go ask Reyna for the file again. Oh, nice! Let's see. Oh, oh, I was paying attention to chat and went the wrong door. Ah! <laughs> yeah, so the first- the, this run's kind of interesting that the first half is very casual running around just doing items, and then the second half is like five bosses in a row. So you'll kind of see it's going to be very casual for this first section for a little bit longer. Okay, so we told Reyna that we need a BIOS, and we find a receipt that tells us what the name of this computer is. Oops. And then we tell that to her. Okay, please talk again. There we go. 
Alright, so now he sends us to Raina, and now we have to kill like 30 seconds of our just waiting for her to download the file onto a CD. So let's see, I should probably scroll my notes down. Nope, not yet. Almost. <laughs> yeah, there is actually combat in the game, so it is actually pretty fun so far. Since I just finished routing it yesterday, so it's still not optimized very well. Oops. Alright, but we've got- Alright, is there gonna be a spawn here? Nope, okay, good. There's a random chance an enemy kind of will appear there or not appear. There's two enemies in this room, but as long as we're quick, we can kind of just walk past them. Yep, I hear you over there. Okay, so we basically used a life- Hello! We used a system that detects life- Life is in the building. And we went through all that just to basically get back. Nope, there's no life in this building besides you. So now we have to go tell Reyna that. And then we can move on to the next part of the game. And now we're at the- Random spawn. Please don't, please don't, please don't. Ah! Ah! Oh! We're good! We're good! <laughs> Woof! Alright, Raina, come meet me later. Alright, and now we'll be done with this area. Did not spawn a second time. Alright, hi Raina. And so now we just have to call Tanya. Alright, this part we can't skip, so we actually got a second. Like, Tanya, we know you're evil when you're just like, Hey, there's that mis random shed. Go there. Go there. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Alright, now we have to click on shed. Split. Okay, so we're actually doing a little better than last time by not much, but actually six seconds is a lot in speedrunning terms, I guess. Let's see. Ah! No! I, I messed up. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, I do like that random spawn one, just because it's kind of fun. I'm like, do I have to panic or do I not panic? Okay, so this is where I need... Does Reyna have everything? She should be fine. Okay. Alright, we didn't miss this time. Game, I'd appreciate it if my bullets did things. So you can't hit an enemy when they're in stun lock for some reason, because this game is weird that way. Alright, so we're going to the microbiology lab now, except... Not quite. Oh uh, yeah, so the way I translated it, I didn't add anything extra, so it should be the same amount of time no matter what. So it should be able to run both at the same time. Oh, hold on. And yeah, the, you can find the ISO pretty easily if you just Google like seven names in English. It, there's a couple of sites that uh, Mr. Nobody posted it on, so you can find it without much issue. And since there's no currently a speedrun category for this, I was gonna submit one once I get a run going. So, that should make me the moderator of it. Okay, so now we heard that Christy's in danger, so now we have to run all the way back. Which thankfully isn't terribly far. Oh, that was a good split. Oh yeah, because I actually, uh... Last time I ran out of pistol bullets and had to knife fight those two guys. Paul Reyna was face tanking them, which didn't exactly work super well.
Let's see, I'm actually not sure if I have to kill this guy. I'm gonna see if I can just shoot him and take the pendant. <laughs> Raina, please move! Raina! Raina, please! There we go. I don't actually know if he died or not. Oh, we'll see. Alright, one very important thing to grab while we're here though is the shotgun. If you play this casually, do not miss the shotgun. I did that on my first playthrough and it sucked. Raina, please! Also, this door is locked for no reason. Even though they both go to the front door, they just don't open that one. Alright, so that was forgot to steal the plot device. Now we're on Deadly Virus meet and greet. Okay. I should probably reload. Um, once you go on the arc, you can't go back. Um, I think if you. It, it's really far from the other areas. Okay, don't focus on that one. Oh! There we go. I'm actually almost out of bullets. I have two pistol bullets left. Alright, I think we'll be fine though. Yeah, the problem is I thought the shotgun would be later on my first playthrough, so I didn't realize that's where it was. So I just never found it, so I had to look it up afterwards. Because I thought it would just be in like the last area or something. But uh, so there's a robot over there who will only let us in if we're Snyder. And so, of course, we can just go over to a videotape of Snyder, record it, and then play it back for the robot, and it'll work perfectly fine. So that's what we're gonna do. I have two bullets. I think I need two bullets. I think this is exactly enough. This is pushing it. Oof. Alright, so back on the second floor of the environmental tech lab. This time, Reyna's in tow with not a whole lot of health. She should be fine, though. There we go. No bullets! It's okay, don't worry about it. And we watch a videotape of Snyder, and then we use the tape recorder. Cool, now we can head back. There's another enemy in this room, but we're just not going to acknowledge it. Whee! I'm trying to think if I should equip any, like, the pistol or anything, but I think I'm okay. Or if I should equip bolts. I don't think I have to shoot anything for a while, per se. I'm not sure how I got the door just then I was way out. Alright. Voice confirmed. So we we talked to this computer over here. They did a micro scan and saw that we're safe. So we gotta take on the safety suits. Uh this is the same version I've heard from you. There hasn't been any updates yet. I really should though. <laughs> So right now there's a deadly virus that's been released, and we're in safety suits. So if our safety suits get hit by an attack or anything, they will rupture and we will be infected by a deadly virus. Which you can fix this, it's just an extreme time loss, which basically just means your run is dead. Thankfully there's actually only one thing you have to do to prevent it from happening. And so it's actually not bad at all. Alright, and this is the thing right here. This is the run killer if you mess this up. Okay. Ooh. 
Okay, so you have to hit that before Reyna gets herself killed. Because this releases gas, which kills all the enemies. And because we have safety suits on, the gas doesn't hurt us. So that enables us to go through this entire thing without having to deal with uh, anything. Uh, so no, the voices are actually Mr. Nobody ran them through a voice synthesizer. So they're actually like Microsoft text-to-speech. <laughs> they're actually like really funny if you listen to them. But yeah, we basically were just like, he's a robot voice, so we'll just literally give him a robot voice. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so we basically went to that door and there was no disinfectant, so we have to go and basically refill their soap dispenser. This is supposed to be harrowing and tense because the enemies are here, but since we killed them all, it's just a nice little jog. And no, you can't just grab this when you first go through here because your character won't find it interesting enough, sadly. That would make things much easier. Nice walk in the zombie park. Well, I mean, we're not at zombies yet. That means spoilers. Okay, so now we're done with this area. So now we basically remove the safety suits. I'm just going to equip the shotgun because I have no handgun bullets. From now on, Reyna's going to have the laser pen because I'm giving her something dangerous. Put the safety suits back because it's required for some reason. She tells us we're okay and we can leave. Woo. Where did I miss the other? I picked up a safety thing last time of handgun bullets. I probably should have done that again. See, Reyna just has fun with the laser pen. Oops. I was thinking the bomb part. We're not at the bomb part yet. Alright, we got the elevator key. Oh, and there we go. We got some bullets. Okay. I should probably just use that for now. Let's see, I'm gonna give Reyna... There we go. That seemed a good time to do some menuing. Ah, excuse me! Don't mind me. Reyna's got you. Alright, use the card key we just got. here. We go over here. Skipping a cutscene, but Reyna gets kidnapped by Tanya. Oh no, she was evil! Who saw that coming? I mean, like, seriously. Alright. Pick up another card key. Oh, come on! There we go. <laughs> that was just bad. Alright. So, Reyna's over here. Oh, did I forget to split or something? Oh, I didn't forget to split. I don't remember what the skip split button is. Oh. You know what? I'll fix it later. <laughs> Alright. So basically, Snyder betrayed the person who betrayed us. So now we have to use a laser cutter to break out. And we got out of the poison filled room. And we forgave Tanya for kidnapping Reyna, and she's gone. And some med packs. Those will probably be for me. You know. Reyna, I don't trust you. For some reason, I'm getting a bad vibe. I'm just gonna have you heal yourself. You're gonna do something stupid. I know it. Probably with that zombie's face. Hey, she didn't actually take damage there. Oh, oh wait. Safety safe? I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to. Uh, did it, did it crash? Oh, it just lagged really hard. I'm on emulator and I think my hard drive was spinning up just then. That was bad timing. <laughs> yeah, Tanya pretty much just leaves. There's actually a glitch where if I go to a certain room, I can actually get Tanya in by party. And she just replaces Reyna for a while. It's really weird and pointless. Okay, so we basically got a mission to, mission to go plant bombs. But I am about to fight a boss. I'm blanking. Am I doing things okay? I think we're fine. Reyna takes a lot of damage here. 
Give me a moment to think about your question. Raina, don't stand in front of the thing! Okay, so far he's giving us much better uh, attack patterns than last time. Alright, we're good! Woo! Uh, so I need to do some more research. I was seeing a couple Dreamcast games uh, were okay with null DC, so that's what I'm using right now. If I find out that one of them doesn't work, then I'll have to change the rules for that. Oops. Well, ignore that golden split because that is definitely not accurate. Yeah, I need to talk with some people who are more knowledgeable about the emulators just to make sure some are allowed and some aren't. Alright, so here's the other card key. I got some express bullets. Raina needs reloading. Yeah, that's a good point. We might have to actually make two different categories then. I'll kind of see how, how things work out. I have the original Japanese game, so I could just run that. But I was try I couldn't get my burn CDs to run on my Dreamcast for some reason. I'm not really sure what's going on with it. Oh, did I just screw something up? I did. Okay, I forgot I had to plant a bomb, and I should have done that. Excuse me! Oh, Raina got hurt there? Really? Raina? Yeah, I think the biggest thing will be if there's any glitches, but... Uh, that's a good idea for Blue Stinger, then yeah, I might have to consider that for this one. Well, my Dreamcast was do was working fine with it earlier, which is the weird part. So I don't know why I was having problems now. Oh nice, I'll have to look at Redream. Yeah, I just kind of been using Null DC for when I was translating this game. I was kind of using that one out of habit. Okay, so probably a bit of a time loss because I forgot something and I had to walk back. Hopefully not by too much. Hopefully Raina doesn't get hit. Okay, we're good. Alright, so now we just gotta go back up. I should probably have safety saved there, but you know what? We're running low on time. Raina, stop getting hit on the simple enemies! Raina! What did I just tell you? Okay, uh... So I've got the shot- oh no no no. I gotta switch to the handgun. Use the ASB bullet because it's an anti-sublimiter bullet. He's a sublimiter. Sublimiter. Well, I didn't mean to give her the notes, but whatever. That should be good. That happens later. We set the bomb in the boss room here. And now we're fighting literally Satan. Alright, and we're good. Ooh. Alright, I'm getting more used to that one. So, I, you can't get into the menu if you're too close to the walls too, I think. So if you run to a certain spot, then I think it makes the menuing easier. Ah. Alright, we plant the bomb here, and then we set the timer. And then this one opens the doors. And these have my nice bullets in it, so I don't want this on right now. Oh, 
Okay, so we left we left that, so now we're like, oh we have to get to the giant super space weapon that's meant to kill everybody. Thank you, Reyna. So now we make our way to the entrance of that, which we conveniently was in Reyna's part of the game. So we can skip all the puzzles because we're not actually doing that part right now. Gotta go around, say hi to the zombie right there. Yep, K, everything is really big. Pardon me. There we go. At least they only take two shots, that's not too long. This one, there's gonna be two strong guys here. If I can stun him for long enough. Perfect. Okay, that seems to be a good strategy so far for that. Alright, so now we're entering the arc. Mm, this might be bad. Okay, that actually worked quite well. Nice. Got an extra pen battery if we need one. Okay, so we gotta make sure to grab the express bullets in this room. Should be... Yep. One right next to us, one right here. Cutscene. Turn around. Okay, let's see. Use one of the things to heal. Need to reload. Yeah, I think from here on I should just stick with the shotgun. Yeah, I got plenty of bullets. Alright, time for Dragon Guard time. Woo! Like Reyna, you are gonna shoot him, right? This is all on you. Reyna! Reyna! Why are you not doing it this time? There we go, okay. So two lasers and a shotgun do that. So that's for the first one. The second one's more annoying. That's a two emergency bed packs here. annoying parts over. Time for the next annoying part. Reyna, why aren't you close enough? There we go. Ah! Okay, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. Hold on. Alright, time for robot. Oof. Yeah, now we're just in the heat of the boss rush. Okay, so he gets stunned. That time he didn't get stunned, so we got a second shot off. dead. Grab the extra express shots. Cutscene time. Cool. We leave. 
So the military is now suddenly after us and about to shoot us out of the sky. We have to do something about that. Morris, we need your help! And he's like, okay, go press the button over there. So we press the button over there. Alright, so now we're safe. But now we have to go say goodbye to Morris. Because Morris is being deleted by Alan because he's a bio computer, so you can delete those. Rip Morris. Oh. Alright, so now we go fight the last boss. Everyone's at full health, so that's actually good. Now let's go! So this guy doesn't stun lock, so you can kind of just keep shooting him. But, uh, Rain is really the challenge of this fight. If she wants to do something stupid. But I've got his attention now. Oh! That was actually really quick. That was like perfect. Raina didn't do anything stupid. Alright. Now we just gotta run to the end of the game. I just gotta make sure I don't get confused. Excuse me. I have no bullets in my gun, but I don't care. I'm at full health. Alright, lag hallway, which for some reason always lags. Okay, so we're back here. Gotta go straight. Up the elevator. Alright, so we gotta stop, activate the thing, talk to Ernest twice, and then he's like, use the pendant! And time! Woo! 37.07, not bad. The game does just kinda end really quickly right there. It's just like, we need to pad the game, quick, throw Gollum in there. <laughs> oh. Thanks! Oh. Yeah, so that was slightly faster than last time. I forget exactly what the other one was. Looks like 23.6 seconds less than before, without that to split. My sum of splits is gonna be wrong because of that time I missed split and then forgot what the shortcut to skip a split was. <laughs> Yes, the other one is probably 3726 then. Woohoo! And then suddenly it's time to go back. Oh! And then ending credits. Alright, so that's actually not bad. I, I'm getting better at the boss fight, so I could probably do it without safety saving. Yeah, because the main thing is just making sure they're full health, especially for the Satan fight. But now that I know where I can go to usually get the menu to pop up, I think that'll be even easier. But woo! Alright, I think I'm going to stop there for the night, though. But thanks to everybody for dropping by and watching. And thanks for that raid earlier, too. <laughs> so yeah, I'll submit this, this run. It'll probably be a while till it gets a category. And then we can kind of figure out emulators that are used and stuff. I do want to see people co-op run this. <laughs> so I need to drag someone along to play this game with me. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Good night.